last shader in a MuGraph category of the material is multi shader. For example, <coughs> in a texture, in a color, we have effects, no, MuGraph, and a multi shader. In a multi shader, you can uh, insert a lots of texture. You can add add <coughs> a lot a lots of texture to cloner object. It's for cloning object. So I insert a simple polygon for inserting of texture <clears throat> then I clone it nice in the cloner the object yeah this number is nice make them if you insert a simple texture on a cloner <coughs> sorry and its material in a color if you load an image you can see it just insert an image to all clone object at once but if you have multi texture you want to <coughs> load on each object individually you have to use shader Re replace the multi shader to the cloner double click going to multi shader i assigned it before from <coughs> MuGraph multi shader and the multi shader in you can hear we have texture one you can load image or color any other shader that you want but if you have a lot of image and you want to <coughs> load them at once you can add a add from folder we have a lot of image in my folder lots of alphabet letter and insert it as you can see I insert a lot of alphabet letter at once in one second. Then it's very important if you want to make them based on index ratio of the cloner, you can see different letter here or basic color brightness, color green. Let's choose a color because we want to randomize it with a cloner and a random <coughs> effector. I explained it before going to the MuGraph effector and a random was that random effector it's randomized <coughs> the position because we changed the mode of the multi shader to the color color brightness or red it's not important just color in a parameter turn off the position and turn on the color mode to color effector now you can see we have a different letter in our MoGraph. And if you want to randomize it with the handle, it's very easy. In its field, you can use a linear field to changing that. Interesting. So this is one benefit of multi shader. Or you can assign different color to your object. That's it.